Hello and welcome back to my channel Learn with Nikhil. So in this video we have taken an another sum on projection of planes where here we have considered an hexagonal lamina. So it is a hexagonal plane. So let's begin. So firstly we have considered these two planes that is the vertical plane and the horizontal plane as you can see here. Now as per the question given we have to consider a hexagonal lamina or a hexagonal plate. So as you can see I have considered a hexagonal plate with six sides. The dimension is given each side is 24 millimeter which we have to construct. Now as per the question given it says that its side, its surface is inclined at 30 degree to the horizontal plane and it's resting on one corner on horizontal plane and you have to draw its projection. So first we have to draw its true shape and then we have to do the inclination. Now as per the question says, it is resting on the horizontal plane on one of its sides. So as you can see, these are the sides, sorry, uh, these are the sides and these are the corners and it is resting on corner on horizontal plane. So I'll take this corner, any one corner you can consider. So I'm considering the shape like this. I've tilted it and this is one of the corner and it is resting on the corner like this on the horizontal plane. And the angle is also given it is resting at an angle of 30 degree to the horizontal plane. So finally, 30 degree will be like this. So 30 degree. So this is 30 degree to the horizontal plane. So this is the final position. So firstly, if you have to consider the true position. So this is the true position. So this is how the plate will be. So if I convert this into 2D. So in the vertical plane for the initial stage there will be a straight line in vertical plane and a hexagonal plate in the horizontal plane that is in the top view. So first we have to draw this and then taking the dimensions upward we will draw a straight line in vertical plane. So this will be the initial position. Now next we have to make it at an angle of 30 degree where one of its corner is resting on the horizontal plane. So here you can consider twisting this. You can consider twisting like this also. So 30 degree you can twist like this also. So here also you can see one of its uh, side is resting on the horizontal plane. Or you can consider like this also. 30 degree. So this angle is 30 degree. Now as you can see how in three dimensional this is the shape it is. Now converting it again into two dimensional. So the front view that is a vertical plane will be a straight line like this and the top view that will be in the horizontal plane it will the shape will be like this. So this is the final stage. So now I'll show you how to draw it on paper. So let's begin. So firstly I'll read the question again. A hexagonal lamina 24 millimeter side has its surface inclined at 30 degree to horizontal plane and resting on one corner on horizontal plane draw its projection. So first step as always you have to draw a horizontal straight line. This is the quadrant or the axis above we have the vertical plane bottom side we have the horizontal plane. So here we will draw the hexagonal lamina. First we will draw the straight line. Mark the center point. Now to draw the hexagon you know you have to draw the circle with radius as 24 millimeter. So I am taking 24 millimeter on the compass. From here I am drawing a circle. Then drawing a straight perpendicular line to the center. Then keeping the pointer on this point, I will start cutting the arcs on the circle. So totally the circle is divided into 6 equal parts and as you know the hexagon has 6 sides. So joining this will provide me an hexagon. I mark the edges of the hexagon as A, B, C, D, E and F. 
so this is how we have created a hexagon there are many methods you can use any one before proceeding i'll just mark the dimension of this hexagon which has given is 24 mm now i'm taking the projections of this edges upward towards the front view that is towards the vertical plane so this is the arrow direction first we have drawn the hexagon taken the projections upward now from the front view the projection will be a straight dark line as you can see in the image also so this point intersection will be a dash this will be b dash f dash this will be c dash e dash this will be d dash so this is the front view now further it says that it is inclined to hp at an angle of 30 degree now this is how this is the horizontal plane and this is the inclination to the horizontal plane at an angle of 30 degree so the inclination will be visible in the front view that is on the upper side that is the vertical plane so we marked a point from this point i'll draw an angle of 30 degree so draw a light line here first then we'll mark the point this will be a dash then you have to project this point or you can measure the distance and mark the point on the inclination as now this front view is inclined at an angle of 30 degree this will be b dash f dash then this will be c dash e dash then the last will be d dash now taking this projection downwards to draw the inclined shape of the hexagon now taking the projections of the true shape of the hexagon towards the other side now marking the points first this is the direction and from here we have taken the projections downward now the intersection a dash and a intersection will be a double dash then b b dash will be b double dash c c dash will be c double dash d d dash will be d double dash e e double dash and finally f double dash now joining this will give us the inclined plane view of the hexagonal lamina as you can see in the image also so this is how you do it so this is the initial position and this is the final position and we are done thank you for watching do subscribe to my channel if you have any doubts any queries let me know in the comment section you can also connect with me on instagram